Homozygous familial hypercholesterolemia, or HOFH, is a rare hereditary disease and, if left untreated, can lead to premature heart disease. But outcomes can be improved with early identification and diagnosis. Pharmaceutical company Ultragenics supports initiatives to aid that all-important early detection and is committed to supporting people living with HOFH and their doctors and caregivers. Cardiovascular disease is the number one cause of death worldwide. Often known as the silent killer, many people don't even know they have it. We often associate it with lifestyle and diet, but some forms of cardiovascular disease are genetic. One condition, called homozygous familial hypercholesterolemia, is inherited from both parents. It causes dangerously high levels of cholesterol, and it's very rare. At the moment, experts believe there are upwards of 200 people in the UK currently with homozygous FH, but only around 70 of those have actually been diagnosed, so there's a real need to find and treat the rest. That's because, left untreated, the body is unable to remove cholesterol from the arteries, which get clogged up, predisposing people with homozygous FH to early onset cardiovascular disease. If it's not been picked up, occasionally it'll be, unfortunately, after they've had an event, so they've had their first heart attack or stroke, and then someone thinks, OK, why has this patient had a heart attack or stroke so early? And that's when their cholesterol levels are measured for the first time. Ultragenics specialises in discovering and developing therapies for people with rare and ultra-rare diseases. Creating therapies for diseases like homozygous FH, when only a few hundred people have it, presents its challenges. First, you have to identify them. You are trying to find a needle in a haystack. So as an industry, we certainly partner with patient associations and groups and physician groups to educate, to communicate, to create greater awareness. And really it's all about making sure if there are signs or symptoms that a light bulb goes on that you either test or you refer to a specialist centre um, and make sure that those patients get a, a timely diagnosis. And patients with homozygous FH, they can get um, lumps of cholesterol depositing under their skin, often sort of under their eyes here, or often as sort of lumps um, on their elbows. And so that sort of triggers their, their family doctor to think, you know, why have they got these lumps? Perhaps this is related to their cholesterol levels. The charity Heart UK wants a nationwide programme to screen all 18-month-olds to find every single patient before they get ill. Heart UK knows of a young lady who had to have a triple heart bypass at the age of 21. So this isn't normal, and this is exactly what homozygous does if you're not diagnosed at a very, very young age. And it's extremely costly to the NHS for somebody to have a triple heart bypass. And... It's, it's not just that, it's the heart attacks that are happening that also are extremely costly. And prevention is absolutely the name of the game here. We need to get in there early so we can prevent this because actually it is preventable. And we've got some really quite effective treatments to lower the cholesterol in these patients. So we just need to make sure that we make the diagnosis and, and get in there early. And that's the key. The sooner someone is diagnosed with homozygous FH, the greater their chance of effective treatment to live a fuller, healthier and happier life.